Did you know that in 1916, there was a proposed amendment to the US Constitution that would put all acts of war to a national vote, and anyone voting yes would have to register as a volunteer for service in the United States Army? Let's dive into this fascinating piece of history. The Proposed Amendment In the midst of World War I, many Americans were concerned about the possibility of the United States being drawn into the conflict. In response, Congressman Charles Augustus Lindbergh Sr. of Minnesota, father of the famous aviator Charles Lindbergh, proposed an amendment to the US Constitution in 1916. The amendment, known as the Lindbergh Amendment, aimed to put the decision of going to war in the hands of American citizens through a national vote. The amendment had a unique twist. If you voted in favor of going to war, you were also committing yourself to register as a volunteer for service in the United States Army. This provision was designed to ensure that those advocating for war would be the ones to bear the responsibility of fighting it. Reactions to the proposed amendment The Lindbergh Amendment garnered mixed reactions from the public and politicians. Some people believed that the amendment would make it more difficult for the United States to enter a war without a clear consensus from the public. They argued that this would make politicians think twice before advocating for military action as they would now be held accountable for their decisions. Others, however, were concerned that the amendment would undermine the authority of the President and Congress to make decisions related to national security. Critics argued that the proposed amendment would weaken the government's ability to act swiftly and decisively in times of crisis. Despite these differing opinions, the Lindbergh Amendment did not gain enough traction to move forward in the legislative process. The amendment was never voted on by Congress and eventually faded into obscurity. The United States enters World War I. Although the Lindbergh Amendment was not adopted, the question of American involvement in World War I persisted. In April 1917, just a year after the amendment was proposed, the United States officially entered the war. President Woodrow Wilson asked Congress for a declaration of war against Germany, citing Germany's unrestricted submarine warfare and the interception of the Zimmermann telegram, which proposed a military alliance between Germany and Mexico. Congress approved the declaration of war, and the United States joined the Allied powers in their fight against the Central Powers. The United States' entry into the conflict marked a turning point in the war, and American troops played a crucial role in helping to bring the war to an end in November 1918. Impact of the Lindbergh Amendment While the Lindbergh Amendment did not become part of the US Constitution, it did spark important discussions about the role of the public in decisions related to war. The idea of tying a vote for war to personal responsibility resonated with many people and influenced debates on the subject for years to come. This is your host Arthur, signing off. Stay curious and see you in our next video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating stories. Keep exploring and discovering the lesser-known events that shaped our world 